another $500 in ClickBank commissions. Now, in this video today, I'm gonna to show you proof of me earning those commissions, but more importantly, I wanna show you how I earn them. And I was able to earn these commissions without spending more money on traffic or even generating new leads. You don't wanna miss this video? We're starting right now. What's up guys, my name is John McNeil and if this is the very first time you've come to my channel, I wanna welcome you here. On this channel, we teach you all about affiliate marketing, making money online, as well as entrepreneurship. So if that interests you, definitely subscribe to the channel, click the notifications so you don't miss any of my future videos. Now, like I said, guys, in this video today, I'm gonna to be showing you how I generated those commissions, roughly $500 today in ClickBank commissions. And I wanna show you how, because I wanna kinda of show you a model that, you know, big companies are using right now, companies like Amazon, companies like Walmart, and now we can actually take this model and we can use it for our affiliate marketing businesses to actually take traffic that's already there in the ecosystem and make a lot more money. So let's go ahead and jump right into the video. All right, guys, so I'm here in my ClickBank account and I wanted to show you the income proof. So you can see here that I actually generated um, a total of $457.56 here. Um, I can refresh a couple of times so you guys see that this is real income. I refreshed three, four times, $457.46, nearly $500 uh, in one day. So now let's actually get to the good and important part. How did this happen? Because I didn't have to actually generate any traffic or any new leads. So I want to kind of show you this model that the huge corporate companies are using to generate more income, doubling, tripling, and quadrupling their income. And I wanna show you how you can actually do that with your affiliate marketing business. All right, guys, so let me give you a quick example. So let's actually talk about like Amazon and their model of how they make millions and billions of dollars, right? So what happens on Amazon, you have people that are searching for products that they need and want. So for instance, say I'm on Amazon and I actually want a basketball hoop. And this actually happened because I actually bought a basketball hoop uh, about a month ago. So I, I search Amazon and here is my little basketball hoop here. Um, that's a terrible basketball hoop, but just say this is a basketball hoop and my hoop <laughs> and then so what ends up happening is they're saying the hoop is a hundred let's just say a hundred and fifty nine dollars to go buy this hoop here and then what happens with Amazon is I'm looking at this hoop and I'm seeing it I'm reading reviews and it's giving me all the description and all the cool things right and so what happens is what Amazon does is it has like what they call this suggested section right and then into the suggested section, you're gonna have a product here, you're gonna have a product here, you're gonna have a product here, you're gonna have a product here. So I'm already in the market, obviously, for this uh, basketball hoop here. And what Amazon does is, is they're saying, okay, this guy wants a basketball hoop, he's in the market for a basketball hoop, he's about to buy a basketball hoop, so let us suggest a couple of things that he might need with his basketball hoop. So this first product could be like a net. This product could be a ball, like maybe I need another basketball, right? This product could be an air pump, right? And this product could be, I don't know, something that's related to basketball, I don't know, right? And so what ends up happening is because I want this basketball hoop, I'm like, okay, well, I need to get another uh, basketball. So I'm gonna say, let me go ahead and pick up this. So let's add that to the tally. I definitely need an air pump. So it's gonna add that to the tally. So now that, you know, I have kind of looked at some of this stuff, you know, I bought the, the basketball hoop here I've got a ball here and I picked up an air pump here. So now I was only gonna make 100, or Amazon was only gonna make $159 here, but now they probably made closer to 
total, you know, with taxes or whatever the case may be, let's say it's $200. So exponentially, they increase their sales by suggesting uh, products and recommending products that I will actually need if I want to have a great experience with this basketball hoop, right? So I hope that makes sense. So what I'm trying to get to, guys, is that's what I'm doing with my affiliate marketing business right now. What I'm doing is I'm recommending platforms, affiliate marketing platforms that give great value and great training. And it's actually helping people. It's not just garbage. It's actually helping people learn how to do affiliate marketing. I don't care what niche you're in. I don't care if you're in the weight loss, dating, whatever you want to sell online. If you want to sell a digital product or a physical product and you want to figure out how you can actually sell that as an affiliate, I have a platform that you can actually get trained on, right? And then in the process of people going in there and they're getting trained, obviously there's things that you're gonna need. Just like in this example here, if I get a basketball hoop, I need a basketball, right? If I have a basketball, I need an air pump to pump it up. It's not like it's a choice or anything. I have to have these additional tools in order to get the desired result, which is me having fun playing basketball. And the same thing with affiliate marketing, there's certain tools that you need, there's certain things that you have to do, there's ways you have to get traffic in order to make money online. So if you're serious about making money online, if you're serious about making money with affiliate marketing, definitely check the link in the description. There's a free course that you can actually get access to. And then there's gonna be other things in there that you can actually see where you can really turn up your income in a major way and start making commissions. Again, the $500 that I earned wasn't from like new leads or new traffic that I generated. It was people that was already in the in the marketplace, right? It was people that was already in the marketplace and they determined that they needed something else in order to build their business. So they made other purchases. That's true autopilot money, right? That's how you really make money on autopilot as an affiliate marketer. So check the link in the description. There's some free training for you guys. I hope that um, this information helped you out. And I hope that you understand it. Make sure you hit that like button if you like this video and make sure you subscribe to the channel and I'll see you guys on the next video. Peace.